Hi, I'm Chris Thomas with Martin Guitar here at the 2013 NAMM Show, rolling out some few, a few new models. This is our bass guitar, the first bass in the Performing Artist Series. This is our typical jumbo shape with a cutaway, a solid Sitka spruce top with rosewood fingerboard and bridge, a Performing Artist style pick guard, Sapili back and sides. Uh, comes equipped with the Fishman Analog Stage Ready Pickup, really nice tuner, volume knob, and a, a mid uh, scoop sweep on the on the uh, tone knob. Nice Spanish cedar neck, some really attractive uh, black chrome tuners. This comes equipped with Martin SP bass strings and of course the Stage Ready. Uh, very affordable price. This is the uh, gloss top, satin back and sides. So um, just rolling this out. This is uh, currently the only base in our in our lineup. So I'm very excited to have it here. And that is the BCPA4 base. This is um, the D28-1931 Authentic. This is a, a very true to form replica of our museum piece uh, that we brought along with us to NAMM this year. Basically with the new Authentic series, we've taken five really uh, special guitars from our museum to the museum, to the Smithsonian rather, to have them cat scan. To see all the little nuances of the, the wood thickness of the top and the bridge and the fingerboard. We've recreated them using hide glue and the old world construction. This particular model is a 12th uh, fret dreadnought, Madagascar rosewood back and sides, slotted head, um, ebony truss rod, and also in this suite are a 14th fret version of this guitar from 1941, D28, as well as a D45, OM18, and a D18 authentic. So here I have a 0042 John Mayer model. Last year we rolled out a 45 version that was very limited and sold out immediately. We came back this year with a, an ongoing model. This is the 0042 John Mayer. Uh, John had this great idea to continue the pearl inlay through the fingerboard that came around the rosette. So we uh, continue that on this model. Obviously ebony, a fingerboard and bridge, found in ivory. Beautiful Coca Cola head weight. And that, of course, matches the Coca Cola back and sides. It's a very uh, rich sounding bass tone wood. And John has been getting into these smaller parlor guitars in the last few years. Um, it's kind of inspiring him to uh, call it the stagecoach. Version. This is actually the cowboy version of uh, 42 style, which um, inspired by the double of 45 we did for John.